Okay, what's up guys? Um, this is Xdeath Evan speaking on behalf of Dinks Forward PT's uh, original community project thing. I have no idea when the last video that wasn't Rob J's recorded was uploaded. I barely followed the channel very much anymore nowadays, but uh, whatever, let's move on to the... Um, so yeah, out of pure boredom and the feeling that I need to get more videos up on the net, which I've been doing lately on my own personal channel, I made this post. So I'm going to make a video on Mouse Stink Dev because someone, yes someone, couldn't be bothered to make one. Procrastination at its finest, am I right? So let's just uh, refresh I think. Let's see if there's any more posts on it. No, nothing. Okay, so close browser. As you can see I've downloaded it just a moment ago and well, let's take a look, shall we? So let's just click play here. Okay, before you play, um, use the control key to swap between melee and ranged weapon modes. In melee mode, click to where you want to move, or click a sprite to interact with it. In ranged weapon mode, you cannot move, and the mouse controls aim and shooting. Press enter for the inventory screen, press space for the console, and escape to remove. Escape menu works as normal. In the inventory screen, there are six places for equipment from left to right, top to bottom, melee weapon, range weapon, shield, armor, magic, and accessory. Don't worry about remembering this because, of the, game, because the game will only allow you to place an appropriate item into one of those slots. Obviously, these will be labeled in a proper game. Yeah, okay, so this is a beta thing that's been on the DN for quite a while then. Placing the green potion in the accessory slot will cause all your weapons to have a poison tip. Oh, that's interesting. Each consecutive hit will speed up the poison. Also, I want the mouse to be visible at all times so it has a large Q, I think. But it actually crawls along the ground so you need to click at people's feet. A larger, a larger cursor and SPQ of zero is probably more appropriate. Do not try to cross the screens past the grey tiles. There are no screens there. There are only six. Credits. The poison potion was nicked from my Fiat, F-I-A-T, graphics folder. That's another demod. So Redick 1, Dang, Walmart probably deserves credit for that. Okay. The health bar script is a fairly heavily modified version of the one by Magic Man and Rabbit Wolf 9, and the graphics are from them. Okay, then. All the contributors to the Dinksy reference file for version 4.0. So credits for thanks to them, I guess. With, it, with this, it only took me an hour to remember everything I had forgotten about Dinksy after not touching it for years, and was an awesome help along the way. I had to, I had it open most of the time while I was scripting. So, hello. Uh, da -da -da -dun. Okay. Ah. Ah, okay, so this, this is like a Diablo sort of thing. Oh, I'm pushing a barrel, I'm pushing a barrel. <laughs> Whee! Can I hit it? Right click, does nothing. Um, so, let's try... Ah, okay, so... Do we drag it or... Ah, okay. So, let's put it... No, that didn't... No? What am I doing? How do I put this back? Um, um, assume shift still fires magic? No? It, that's... Okay, um, walking through barrel. Walking through rock, sorry. I think that's supposed to be a grey area there, so I'm not... Oh my goodness. Whoa, what the hell? Okay, that's a... That's an aggressive pill bug. Uh, lovely, lovely. That's an aggressive pill bug. That's very interesting. Um, let's just repeat, retreat to the last screen. Go on. Good dink. Uh, the rock has disappeared. Okay, um, uh, maybe it's control. What? Okay, um, that's not doing. Okay, so control key was switching between think and a bow at the moment and it's not doing anything. Shift is doing nothing. Um, maybe those are supposed to be the in inventory or something. I, what's that do? Uh, control key is that now it's still no changes. 
Space, I'm... Okay, space just does nothing. I can't remember what... It, I cannot remember a single thing that I read before, so... Um, what am I doing? What? 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 Okay, maybe I should have read that post a little bit further. Um, so I can't drag those to there. Oh! Okay, so I can put that sword there and it increases my statistics. Um, I can put the fireball there and... Oh! Suddenly it's charging! Okay, so... Um, we now have a weapon. Control switches me to that bow. And back to this. I still... What? 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 Okay, so that's not a regular fireball. That's very interesting. Let's, um... If we do that... Okay, so that is not a scripted barrel, I suppose. So I just go zoom. And it's just punching the barrel. It's... Yeah, okay, so that... Uh, that's... Uh, blocked. Screen. Oh god. Uh... Wow, that was laggy. Oh. Okay, so the only way I know how to attack right now is using that fireball spell. A little bit buggy, but it homes in on enemies. Ow. It seems to home in on the enemies, or try to. That's a very effective spell to use. If you're um, more interested in staying alive and keeping distance. I don't even have to try and attack. I don't know how to attack or whatever. But I don't have to. I can just... Okay, spacebar's still just coming up with those. I don't know what that's doing, so... Um... No, 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 no. I... Ah, control. I'm trying to keep the regular dink controls in my mind while working out what you're doing is a little bit difficult, so... Um... Okay, um, that still does nothing, so let's... Run for it again, I guess? Yeah. That is very confusing interface, I've got to say. Um... Yeah. So, that doesn't seem to do much. I can't put that anywhere except back in these boxes. Oh, now I've got a bow. Ooh, okay. Uh, so you click once, and click again to fire it. Okay. That's very interesting. Okay, so... I've worked out now how to get the bow going. Um, so the bow was placed up there for it to work. What if I plant, try and plant a sword? It doesn't seem to work. Okay. I can't place the sword there or there. This thing's uh, armor from Doom, by the looks of it on the inventory thing. That still switches between the bow and that. That, um, I've got a ring. So, armor function, I guess. So, if that's supposed to be our weapon slot, then I know you can put the bow up there. I've already worked that out. Why can I not put a melee weapon on there already? Okay. Uh... I don't know what I'm doing here. This is very, very strange. Uh, let's keep that there. That's obviously just a fist icon until I put a sword there. Then it changes the statistics. That seems to be the only thing that does. Let's put this one down here now and put this one up here. And yes, they're pretty much the same sword, so it doesn't matter. That seems to go there. I don't know how to switch to a melee weapon and try to strike yet, though. That's... Interesting. Okay, so I'm going to have to say bad ratings. Bad. 
tile design. Hello. Okay, so this is a walking, talking person, I suppose, that we can try and interact with. Hey, hold still. Oh. Oh, hello, Dink. Hello there, Dink. Oh, hello there, Dink. Okay, so we can click on him as much as it wants. That's all he says. We click on him from over here, it says the same thing. So we click on them to interact. That's interesting. Okay, save machine is pretty much the same scripting. Let's create a save. No, I don't want to do that again, thank you. Um, okay, we can't... What? Okay, um... So... It's a little bit buggy when I was trying to talk with the save machine. Okay. I still haven't worked out how to use a melee weapon. All I know is that I've got my fireball spell and everything. Oh, there's a bonker now. I am so gonna get killed yet. Run, Dink, run! I actually like the effectiveness of the mouse here, but the melee melee activity, being able to use melee is rather impossible at the moment, from what I can tell. And I can't really hold still with a bonker chasing me. That was a little bit buggy there too. It, uh, those fireballs pretty much just slammed past him and made the punching sound. So they take a moment to activate, I think, before they actually start homing in and to do damage. The first thing the fireballs appear to do is that they just fly out, get into position to attack, then they switch to a damaging mode. Very nifty feature. Loving the spell, that seems to be one of the few things I like, as well as the mouse movement. It seems to use a blue version of a blood sprite or something. Splat. But without any knowing known way that I can think of to try and tackle ow without any known way that I can actively engage with melee then I don't know how effective it would be so yeah it's very interesting so far I mean playing around with bows that we've got available not being able to use a goddamn melee weapon this poison potion thing that it mentioned there, that's interesting. Maybe true that. I still can't place a sword in there. The only thing I've noticed is that you can place the sword here, and that's it. Or anywhere in the inventory spaces. That's all blank. That's... Yeah, it's quite interesting so far. Um, let's try going back over here again. If we press... No, not space. No, not space. No, not space. Okay. Um, control key, was it? Whoa. Laggy. Let's... Okay, so click and... Whoa. What... What was that? So, it's like charging the bow regularly. And then it's point and click. Point and click. Dink still walks over the health. Okay. We have to point and click. It's a little bit awkward, but so far it seems to be quite interesting. And I've been running this video for 13 minutes. Okay. Um, let's try that again, because... Yep, I can still fire... Okay, I think the arrows fly in the direction the mouse wants... The mouse is pointing. So it's... Into something. Yeah, the little bit laggy, a little bit laggy, still. The m mouse, though, when you're aiming the ranged weapon, apparently it will actually fire the arrow where the mouse is pointing. So that adds a very unique method to range method, ranged attacking with a bow, in comparison to vanilla dink, where you have to. Aim in one of the cardinal directions, as it were, north, south, east, west, or on a specific north, south, nor north, east, south, west sort of angle. So, they would fire on this am angle, sort of normally, on the original. Interesting. Whereas, on this, we can give them specific, a more specific approach. Kind of like those fireballs on the other screen on the opposite end. So yeah, this um, this is Mouse Dev Beta.
I mean, I wish I wish there were an active way that I could use melee attack. I have not worked it out yet. Um, I hit the alt key there. No, not intentional. Spacebar just seems to do that. And then, okay, it's the console thing. That's really useless. Spacebar just goes and opens the type here to uh, to be pro hacks. Scripts console. <laughs> I never really tried to use that personally, so I don't know what it does. I'm just going to move back over here. And okay, so they've maintained their health bars as well. Okay, control key, switch to bow. Switch to bow. I don't know what that beeping is. I think it's complaining. I'm hearing beeping. That could just be the laptop complaining about my use of the key. I can't open my inventory screen right now. It's probably that silly console thing. I don't really. That seems to be the only way I've worked out to get rid of it. So, yeah, I can switch the bow again now. So, we'll just skip over here. A little awkward to. It's just a little bit awkward to switch between the weapons, and this seems to be pretty laggy on my Windows 7 laptop. Okay, so the poison does work. God, that's loud! Wow. That is really loud on my headphones. I love that fireball. Okay, I'm sick of you. Thank you for shutting up. So, no melee ability that I can tell so far, just walking around and using weapon. Ranged weapons, okay, they respawn instantly. Let's get out of here. So, ranged weapon attack, we've got our spell, and that's all you can do at the moment in this mouse sync dev. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, I suppose, and congratulations, someone. I've made a video of your demod thing. <laughs> Goodbye. Perpetuate minutes later, I just realized how stupid I am. Ugh. Okay, let's... No, up. Thank you. So, let's try this one more time. Herpaderp, there it is. Melee is possible. I am totally fucking stupid. It should be obvious. I mean, it, honestly, I'm. I wasn't expecting this sort of. Yeah. So it's a little bit awkward, but you can actually use a melee attack. You use it in the same instance mode as walking around. I am just so fucking derp at it. It's literally like a Diablo game, or a Torchlight game, or any of these click-to-attack games. I am just so fucking stupid that I didn't realize it straight away. Had to, I was about to start rendering, and I went and took a look at the thread again, and... Um... derp derp There was a response, so I checked it. And now I know melee is possible. Melee, swords... Flashy things. Is the potion equipped? I can't remember where that potion was supposed to be. Ah, oh, ring. Okay. Derp derp, they were still moving. Hacks. I call hacks. 
I think that only actually hit... Yeah, that... Okay, so melee actually only hits one of the enemies, unlike the original Dink. Where I could have just bashed a group like that all at once, so... Slight difference. But... Yeah, you can still do it. That one I think just vanished, I have no idea, but you can still use melee weapons, so slight correction there. I was wrong, herp a derp, five minutes later, extending the video to include this new fact. Fun, isn't it? Um, so, I still don't, I'm not too sure on this thing though. But other than the homing in fireball spells, and the pill bug which is aiming like you're a mouse. Is it aiming at Dink or the mouse? It's aiming at Dink. Good thing I clicked this then. Perfect timing. Yeah. Very effective. Very effective. I have been thoroughly mind equals blown confused by this damn mod. Thanks for watching. Seriously, this is the end now. And yeah. Okay, my arrow keys aren't working. I quit cannot quit the D mod. No, a little bit of help here. If I got Alt F4, game over. Good fight.